we'll see if my whole entire video is upside down. Okay, so what, hi, hello, my name is Sam. Today I'm gonna to be making some bad decisions. I'm sorry if I come in and out of frame so much, it's because I'm doing my best. Um, so what I'm doing today is dyeing my hair pink. I've already washed it. It's this nice blonde color, nice white blonde. So what I'm gonna be doing today is dyeing it with Ion Color Brilliance Brights Semi-Permanent Rose Intensive Shine. I did a test strand right there. It turned out pretty okay. So I've got my brush bowl, I've got my bowl, I've got my brush, I've got two boxes of color, and um, so I'm just gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna start. So I'm gonna empty out both contents into this bowl, and um, so I'm get you in on some of this action here. So sorry, this is just my crotch. I'm doing my best. So that's one tube, and that is what it looks like. I hope you can see that here. Let me pick this up. So this is what we're working with. It looks really hot pink right now, but I, it's not. <laughs> it's not. Maybe I'll add some dilutant in here. So I have this little. I've got this here just got a tiny bit left I'll just throw it in there why not you know this is the manic panic pastelizer so I'm just gonna dump the rest of this in there that's not gonna fit I'll scoop it out with the little fingers. This probably won't do anything, but that's okay. We won't know until we try. I don't want to run out of color. On my dye shirt which is also a Chipotle t-shirt. I love a Chipotle queen. This is where I did my pink strand test. And it looks like it has already washed out for the most part. And if you see me looking over this way, or over this way, I have mirrors on either side and in front of me. So if you see me duck down, it's because there's a mirror that's holding up the phone. Because my mom taught me, or not taught me, but like growing up, she called them oopies. And um, I didn't realize until way later on in life, these are not called oopies, they're called hair ties. She just calls them oopies. I felt like a real dumb kid when I figured that out.
I didn't miss any spots. Um, now, my head. And uh, we go and process for 20 minutes. So I'm just going to cut the clip here and then I will come back when it's ready. We'll wash it out. It will, will give me a nice little blow dry. And then I will show you the final result. Hello. It's been two days since you've seen that last clip. I totally forgot. So I washed up my hair, dried it, blue dried it. Looked great. It was super pink. Not like super pink, but it, it is a good pink, right? I've since washed my hair once. I filmed that video on a Saturday. It's Thursday now, so it's almost been a full week. I washed my hair once, and um, you can't really tell. It is not super pink anymore. It is almost on the rose gold side of things. Like it's up close, you can tell it's more pink, but on camera, it really shows up more blonde. Um, I will insert a picture somewhere if I can figure that out of what it looked like when I had like fully pink hair just so you can compare like right now one wash later how much this hair dye washed out. Which isn't necessarily a bad thing if you want that you know. I, know, I personally, like, I like to have a fun color in my hair for a week maybe and then call it a day, wash it out, and then I'm back to blonde and that's all good. But if you were to buy this Ion Color Brilliance in Rose, expecting it to last, it's not. It's just not going to last. My hair with one hair wash is like a whole shade lighter. Like, it's... It's, it's a lot. It's a lot lighter. I don't mind. I'm gonna just wash it back out to blonde anyway, but this is kind of like my check-in review. Would I buy it again? Yes, because I like to wash out my hair and have a fun color for a week and then wash it out and dye it another color and then wash it out and dye it another color. But if you want to have pastel pink hair for more than five days or however long that you can keep from washing it, this is not for you. 